First and foremost, I appreciate you guys uh, for coming out. My name is Brian Bean. I am the creator of Extra Digit Income. And what that basically means is we're a community of people, whether it be doctors or lawyers or professionals or network marketers or students, it doesn't matter what walk of life you're from, we believe that whatever your income is right now, if we could just show you how to add an extra digit to it, would that interest you or anybody you know? So in our extra digit community, what we like showing people is how to add a digit and ultimately a comma to your income. And then from there, we teach you how to maintain and manage that money at the same time. Here's why I'm excited about this, because no matter what you're doing right now, how much money you make, you eventually want your money to start working for you. You don't want to be the one working for the money for the rest of your life. Right? So here's the basic concept. I'll give you guys an example. There are two basic things that everybody in this room wakes up every day. When you wake up, there are two basic things you're trying to accomplish when you boil it all down. One is you want to maintain the quality of life that you currently have identified for yourself. Who would agree? That's the first thing. In other words, pay the bills, keep the hounds off, get something to eat, go out to eat, uh, vacation every now and then, have a car, have a home. That's the current situation that you've identified for yourself. You have to pay for that lifestyle. Have I lost anybody yet? Okay. These are called two objectives. The second objective is everybody in this room wants to one day be able to walk away and have enough of retirement where your money keep what? It keeps coming. That's basically why everybody in a capitalistic society, that's why we're waking up every day. So we show you how to do that. There are four problems, though, or challenges you have to overcome when you're trying to do it. Challenge number one, because I don't believe in problems. I just believe in challenges. OK, challenge number one is inflation. See, if you get a cost of living raise, that's fine. But your raise might be three percent, but inflation may be six to eight percent. So that means even if you make more money, if everything else is still more expensive, you're not going to feel it. So what good is your raise if gas went from two dollars to four dollars? What good is your raise if groceries are more what? Expensive. Daycare is more what? Expensive. Health insurance is more what? Expensive. We just established gasoline in your car is more what? Expensive. So if everything is more expensive and your raise is going up with the cost of living, but inflation is going up a lot higher, you will never catch what? Never catch up. Just know the reason a lot of people struggle is because they really think that making more money is the answer. And it's not because you can make as much money as you want. But if it's not at the rate of inflation, you're still going to be behind. All right. I want to make sure this is clear. I'm talking to a group of people tonight as if you really want to create wealth. I'm not talking to a group of people as if, you know, you want to make two, three hundred dollars a week. We're talking about the challenges that are keeping most Americans from getting wealthy. Everybody got me? The second biggest challenge, OK, or the second challenge, period, is taxes. We live in a capitalistic society. I'm not here to show you how to evade paying taxes. I'm here to show you how to use the tax laws to your advantage, like wealthy people do, because that's a large reason or a large part of why or how they got wealthy. They took advantage of the tax laws, whereas people who don't know the tax laws, the government takes more taxes than they should. And that money should be going to you. So a large part of your challenge is taxes. Make sense? I'm going to show you that on the board. Number three, because a lot of your taxes are being taken from you, you end up borrow borrowing the money that the government is taking. So we end up getting in credit card debt because what people are trying to do is catch up and get the money back that the government took. So now, Everything you purchase on credit, you end up purchasing two or three times. So I thought I got the bike on sale for $99 for my child, but I end up really paying $300 for the bike. So I didn't know I was buying him three bikes, but the minute I swiped it, I bought the bike three times. Because think about it. If you had the $99, you would have just what? You'd have paid for it. So I don't know what makes people think that they're going to charge the bike for $99 and then in their mind, you know how they justify it? I'm just going to pay it off next what? Next month. No, it's not, because if it was like that, you wouldn't have had to borrow the 99 in the first place. So you always going to end up swiping that car more than you should, because most of your taxes are being taken out. So now you end up in more what? More debt. That's problem number three. Most Americans biggest two expenses. Debt and taxes. 
what most Americans do though is they go looking for if we just cut that cable bill, get a better cell phone plan, cut out on some of the going out to eat. That's not it. That's chump change. Your biggest chunks are the government and the banks. They're taking most of your income from you. You just don't see it. Does that make sense? And then number three, and we like to call, or number four, we call number four financial literacy. Most of us just don't have what's called financial literacy. Now, our company is the personal finance success system or the personal finance success company providing that system. What that means to you is this. We show people how to meet their two objectives, pay your current pay for your current lifestyle, right? And have your money pay for your future lifestyle. That's the two objectives. Everybody getting up every day, going to work for those two reasons. We got four challenges we got to overcome that's keeping you from making it happen. And I'm about to show you guys the three solutions to those four problems. If you can get in your mind right now, I got some people in my head that need to see what he's talking about. Then we can help you achieve your goals. It's really just that simple. Everybody got it? So here's a concept I want to introduce you guys to. It's not, it's not to insult anybody's intelligence. It's not that you don't already know it. But finally, you got a system that you can put that knowledge into and get paid. All right, here we go. Real simple.